Lee, tell him who I beat. I think that's kind of stayed with me all these years. From Wales, Philip Price. This must go in for Europe. Curtis has his own way of putting out his 12 guys, and I have my way. Uh, we'll only know who was right tomorrow night. If it comes down to the last two matches, he might be looking favourite. If it doesn't... I felt really good, actually, because um, I played against him and David Toms in the four foursomes the day before. And I was playing quite well. Uh, we lost, but I, I, I felt pretty good about it. I, I think the course suited me more than him, uh, and I played really well in practice, and I, I, quite, quite, I thought I had a good chance. Here's Philip Price at 16. He's two up and he's got a birdie putt. He has putted so well today, but it's down the hill, it's difficult. But he's got the line and he's made a birdie. And Philip Price puts the pressure on Phil Mickelson. Phil Mickelson must hold this to keep the game alive. I was three up early on in the match, um, and I was pretty much hanging on for most of the day that from there on. Um, just relief, you know, putt's gone in, and I won my point. Just, just glad it was over, I think. have won back the Ryder Cup. You know, I hear this every week at some point. Lee Westwood was announcing all our team, you know, who'd, who'd, who'd beaten who, and uh, in order that the team would get up on a big table. So it was my turn to get up, so I shouted before I got up. I said, Lee, tell them who I beat. I think that's kind of stayed with me all these years.